Hello everyone. Welcome to latest update program. The topic of discussion is thorium nuclear reactor. This topic relates to science and technology. China has achieved a significant milestone by constructing the world's first thorium-based nuclear reactor, the thorium molten salt reactor, TMSR, in the Gobi Desert, Wuyi City, Gansu Province. This reactor generating 2 megawatts of electricity, marks a major step forward in nuclear energy technology. The project, launched in October 2023, aims to address global energy challenges with a safer and more sustainable nuclear energy source. Before moving further, an important announcement. The next offline batch of the IASGS Foundation course, Prelims plus Mains, is starting soon at Drishti IAS, Noida, the English medium batch will begin on 7th May at 8 a.m. And the Hindi medium batch will start on 29th April at 6 p.m. For more details, contact 87501 Now let's discuss what is thorium-based nuclear reactor. Thorium-based nuclear reactor uses thorium-232 as a primary fuel instead of uranium-235 or plutonium-239. Thorium is not a fissile material, but a fertile material, meaning it requires pairing with uranium-235 or plutonium-239 to be used as nuclear fuel. To initiate and sustain the nuclear reaction, thorium must be used along with fissile material, such as 233U, 235U or 239PU. Fuel cycle strategies. Thorium with low enriched uranium. LEU. LEU has a 235U enrichment of 19.75% and is mixed with thorium to form thorium LEU mixed oxide, MOX fuel. Thorium with plutonium, PU. This configuration uses plutonium as an external fissile fee. Now, moving on to information about thorium. Thorium is a silvery, slightly radioactive metal. It is commonly found in igneous rocks and heavy mineral sand. Thorium is three times more abundant in the Earth's crust than uranium, with an average concentration of 10.5 parts per million ppm of thorium, compared with about 3 ppm of uranium. The only naturally occurring isotope of thorium is thorium-232, which is fissionable, can undergo fission, but not fissile, cannot sustain a chain reaction, without external neutrons. Thorium-232 requires high-energy neutrons to undergo fission. Now is the time for PYQ, UPSCSE 2020. In India, why are some nuclear reactors kept under IAEA safeguards while others are not? A. Some use uranium and others use thorium. B. Some use imported uranium and others use domestic supplies. C. Some are operated by foreign enterprises and others are operated by domestic enterprises. D. Some are state-owned and others are privately owned. Send the answer for this question in the comment section. Thanks for watching. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe. And do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications.